Hello and welcome aviation enthusiasts. Today we have a fascinating aircraft to discuss. The AirTran Boeing 717-231 registered as November 9 or 33 Alpha Tango. Join us as we dive into its history, first flight and its journey with multiple companies and the many liveries it proudly wore. Let's begin with a brief overview of the Boeing 717. The Boeing 717 is a twin engine single aisle jetliner developed from the McDonnell Douglas MD-95. It's known for its efficiency, reliability and comfortable cabin. Now let's meet our star. It first took to the skies in June of 2000 and has so far served with three different airlines in its passenger paying career. It sports two BMW Rolls-Royce BR715 engines which produce 18,920 pounds force or 84 kilonewtons each, carrying up to 117 paying passengers in a one-class layout with a range of over 1,400 nautical miles or 2,600 kilometers. The aircraft was first delivered to Transworld Airways, otherwise known as TWA, on June 8th of 2000 in St. Louis, Missouri. The aircraft was painted in the last TWA. WA livery with a double globe scheme on the fuselage and registered as November 2404 Alpha. However, events in the real world conspired with any long-term use of this aircraft with TWA. By the end of 2001, TWA had been merged into American Airlines and unlike several of this aircraft's siblings with TWA, it was not taken into American Airlines service but instead was stored at Victorville Aircraft Boneyard in February of 2002. In June of 2003, the aircraft was leased by the Atlanta-based low-cost airline Airtran Airways. The registry was changed to November 9033 Alpha Tango, and the aircraft was initially painted in the standard three color livery Air Transported for most of its short history. During 2005, Air Tran partnered with Sirius Radio, and to show that off to other flyers, the face of rock star Elton John was painted on both sides of this aircraft. This change in the livery would only last through 2005. The aircraft continued flying with Air Tran until 2013, when Air Tran was merged into Southwest Airlines. Since all of Air Tran 717s would not fit in the 737 only fleet found on Southwest Airlines. Most, if not all, of 717s were then leased to Delta Airlines. Delta would repaint the aircraft in the modern onward and upwards livery that is still found on Delta aircraft in 2023. Delta used this infusion of relatively new aircraft to retire their older DC-9s and MD-95s. The lease that Delta had from AirTran would last until 2021, when other arrangements were made. At the height of the COVID-19 pandemic, this aircraft was temporarily stored in Birmingham, Alabama from March of 2020 until April of 2022. The aircraft continues flying with Delta Airlines today in late 2023. In conclusion, this AirTran Boeing 717-231 is a symbol of the aviation industry's rich history. It went above and beyond to connect people and places. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the life and times of this aircraft. We hope you've enjoyed this exploration. Now, if you have any questions or you'd like to share your own experiences with this aircraft, feel free to ask. We're here to engage with fellow aviation enthusiasts. Remember, the skies hold countless stories, and this aircraft is just one of them. Stay tuned for more exciting aviation adventures. See you in the next video. The video on the screen now is a one hundred scale model produced by a company called Gemini Jets in 2005. This particular model has so far in the middle of 2023 been the only one made for any scale and from any other manufacturer. For any enterprise that is interested, this channel is available for advertising for your company. This opportunity is available for all reputable North American companies. Please contact me at the shown email address for details. This channel survives with you, the viewer, and your ongoing support. The more you watch my videos from start to finish helps me get a larger distribution which will bring in more subscribers that will then repeat this process. If you like what you've seen, hit those like buttons and spread the word. We've enjoyed making this video and we hope you've had fun watching it. Thank you and good day.